Uh, heritage is an important issue in our city, not just because at one time we were the provincial capital, um, not just because we're a small city of seven square miles, and that's what we have to work with, and so we better get it right, because, because uh, it's a small city and things are noticeable. Uh, but it's important because it's important for the public good. It's important for the public good that we work to preserve buildings that are beautiful and that add to the community and add to the attractiveness of the community. It's important that we try to honor the history of the average people who've, who've lived in this city and have lived through plagues and epidemics and the great fire and have built the city. And, and it's important uh, that we, uh, we work to preserve some of our working class history. And, and I hope to do that uh, you know, I hope that we can uh, rescue the gas work site. It's like, oh, one of the oldest industrial buildings still existing in British Columbia, going back to 1886. Um, but also because heritage can inform the present. You know, we know that the waterfront used to be accessible to the public. And so, so we can take that and be inspired by the past and say, yes, we can do that again. We can restore the waterfront. It doesn't have to be empty lots. It didn't used to be empty lots. And uh, so we can draw from the past and we can learn from the past in that way to, to also serve the common good. And uh, the city's heritage is tied in with, uh, with, with all of our heritage. And, and I underline the word all. It's a multicultural city. And it has been a multicultural city from the beginning. We used to have the largest Chinatown in British Columbia at one time, but a large Japanese community. Uh, We've had Greek communities, Italian communities, Irish, Irish communities in, in our city. Uh, we used to be a, a center uh, for the church and Catholicism when, in the early days of the province when uh, hospitals and, and uh, schools were being built for the first time. And so I think that uh, when we honor our heritage and, and we work to preserve our heritage, we're really working to preserve the public good and the memory of what's been achieved and the beauty of our city.